Hi guys, welcome back. Uh, the match I have for you today is on one of my favourite maps for Hag, Midwich. Um, when I loaded into this lobby and I saw four Claudettes, I just kind of got a feeling they were going to burn them up. So I decided to put a sacrificial ward on and what do you know, <laughs> there's one of the times when burning the ward actually helped. They wanted to go to Macmillan. Um, thanks to the ward we got Midwich, which is one of my favourite maps for Hag. Not the favourite, that would be RPD, but this one's pretty good too. Um, I, see, I see these two straight away, but I, I don't have any traps down, so I want to set up first. That trap there is good. This trap on the stairs is also very good. You can, you can barely see it because of the dark floor. And it, you usually catch people with that trap. Um, I also like the traps at the front door here. There's a nice mist hit on Ace, but... And desperate to get that flashlight off him. There he goes. Now this part here on Midwich, if you're facing a hag, you don't want to be in here. If you are, you want to get away from this area as quickly as you can. Because as you can see, I can trap both sides. And without breaking that door in, you have no way to get out. Ace already came back and tripped the one trap, and now I'm funneling him towards my other one. And there's nowhere for him to go. And there's the down. Um... Ace was one of the ones who was also a Claudette, and he last minute switched as the ma uh, match was about to go in, and he also put on a flashlight. It's very important as Hag that I get rid of that flashlight, as he's going to get rid of my prep if I don't. And this Claudette, that was a nice fake there by Claudette, luckily I didn't fall for it. Um, oh, I tend to do with Hag, you see her? she's gone out of sight there, she can't see me. I place a trap, now she probably expects that, good survivors will, but she still comes back. To trip it and what she doesn't expect is for me to teleport straight away then for some reason she tries to hide inside me and doesn't make any distance so that's another easy down when I'm playing hag I'm usually spamming my teleport button not always there will be times when I won't want to teleport or I'm in a chase in a certain area and I don't want to leave but mostly I am spamming the teleport button to get a fast teleport as soon as I teleport I hit most times this will get you a hit didn't hit the one I wanted there but it's still good because now and there we've got all of them injured nobody's gone for the unhook I, in fact I think the one on the unhook killed herself she, she put herself into second and gave up she didn't want to play that trap there this is a good trap by, by the doors either side and even in the courtyard as well in the middle you can put traps Midwich is so good for Hag because of the shape of the map being a square and there isn't many open places. You, you're funneled into areas because of the corridors and things and you can easily push them where you want them to go. It, it, it's a good map I recommend if you have Midwich offerings to burn it and, and learn good trap placement on it. That would, that would have been a hit had he, that was a good dead heart that he did there but we just replace the trap and we do it again he runs off upstairs this ramp here is a good place to trap as well I catch a few people with the trap there and as we go out here I, li I do like to trap this, this corridor here as a lot of people tend to run out of that room and head for this window to drop into the courtyard uh, I think Ace is upset as he's the one that burnt the map we find out at the end and, and he didn't like losing his flashlight so he's given me a few little bags but that's okay and Claudette here trips my trap so we come off ace and we go back onto her a few miss hits in this game but that's okay everybody misses it's okay to miss it, it does happen that pulled her off track there she dead holds into the wall and the down and because I don't want to hook her because I know she'll give up the two others have. She will too. I'm no, under no doubt that this is a team. And Ace will get the hatch. And I want Ace for the, the bags. I'm sorry. <clears throat> I know it's petty. And some people would say just ignore it. But no, I want you. You bagged me. Let's go. Now this, this trap here is going to... I didn't teleport straight away. Because he would have avoided it. But I push him back. And I can teleport just in time as he runs back towards the trap to get the hit every place because you never know we'll end up in this area again he's moonwalking here as you can see uh, if he'd have been walking normally he may have seen that he was actually moonwalking towards a trap that I placed earlier 
So th this is a video that I did put on TikTok. It's one of my clips on TikTok, and I wanted to put the whole game. In case you didn't know, that is a way you can actually teabag yourself as hag. If you start, and I know it's petty, I'm sorry. If if you start to draw a trap and then stop, she bends over, and it it it, it imitates the teabagging that survivors more commonly do to killers. So yeah, yes, I'm petty. I'm sorry. And a nice little slap there as well for being rude. I'd like to stress that I I only do this if the survivors are rude to me for no reason, as I didn't camp anybody, I didn't tunnel anyone. I wasn't rude to them, so I don't understand why they have to be rude to me. And Claudette is where I left her, thankfully. So, yeah, that's Midwich. Um, unfortunately, it's not a very long video, so I can't I can't really give you more more info on the traps. Which I hope you can see from from what I did there where I place them. So I hope this video was helpful to you, even just a little bit. Um, if you like the video, a like, comment would always be appreciated. Uh, if you're new, a subscribe would be very much appreciated. And um, I hope to see you all again soon. Thank you very much for watching, and I hope you have a lovely day. Bye.